Let's doodle on some grip tape. So I was at the art supply store the other day picking up my usual Faber-Castell pit artist pen that I use to ink my Simple Routines journal comics and I saw this thing. So it's the same brand, same pit artist pen. It's a giant white paint pen. It's a little bit different than what we usually use to draw on grip tape, but I thought it would be a fun experiment to try this thing out on some grip tape. I need to set up a new board, and so I was thinking, why don't we just fill an entire sheet of grip tape with doodles? All right, so I have a sheet of just some grip tape here, and I haven't thought about what I'm gonna draw. I'm gonna, I wanna fill up the entire sheet of grip tape and then put it on the board, and I haven't really thought about what I'm gonna be drawing. All I know is that I wanna do a bunch of doodles all over this thing to sort of imbue my skateboard with drawing power. <laughs> Uh, so I'm gonna get this camera set up and just start drawing. Sam's here. Oh, that's me. Hey. Hey. Uh, so done with the grip tape. Time to go pick out a board and grip it. Actually, you know who's good at gripping uh, skateboards? Hi. Hey. How you doing? Uh, do you want to help me grip a skateboard? Yeah, I can do that. Greatest hits board. I think will look pretty good on the other side of all when, of this. When you do a kickflip, you're not going to be able to tell which side is up. 
I can't tell all right, what sides enough. up anyway. Uh, okay, yeah. yeah <laughs> all right, let's, so. Let's do some gripping, dude. All right, show me how to do it. All right. We're gonna take the grip tape, we're gonna put it right there, and um, we should go at it. Grip tape on, ready to be trucked and skateboarded on. Sweet, thanks dude. No problem. Okay, so the board's gripped. Andy pointed out that it's gonna be really hard to <laughs> tell the difference. It's exactly the, the same. The top and the bottom <laughs> when I uh, try and kickflip, which is what I've been, I've been trying to get the kickflips down. So maybe this wasn't the best decision <laughs> for, or, or maybe this is exactly what I need. To maybe, be confused? Maybe like I just needed the extra little bit of challenge to to really learn the. You need you need to make it harder for yourself <laughs> yeah. for sure. <laughs> Crap. All right, I'm gonna uh, put put these trucks on and then we'll go go skate. Okay. Cool. We're gonna watch games done quick first though. Oh yeah, we're gonna watch some games done quick. It's JP's face. It is. I love it so much. I said that's your face. Trucks are on. Let's go skate. Okay. All right, Sam. So you say a kickflip test is bad luck. If you don't land the first kickflip, it's bad luck. That's what. That's how I've learned it. Yeah. But I've probably because all I've been doing is trying kickflips lately, uh -huh. and I've landed like five, five yeah. out of probably a thousand or two. Well, if you land it first try with this, that means that is the greatest skateboard of all time. Okay, but if I don't land it... It means you're screwed. <laughs> First try, just commit, you got it. <laughs> Let's do it a lot. There's too much pressure, man. Yeah, I'm too bad, man. Welcome to Street League. Nope. Well, Crap. Wow, it really does look exactly the same on both sides. <laughs> <laughs> All, right. All right, well, now I'm actually going to land it. Okay. I'll do enough tries to land. So that whole session started off with me not coming even close to landing a kickflip and I was getting kind of worried, but then something clicked and I just started landing them. I don't know, I started like committing to the trick, which has always been an issue for me. Yeah, I think this is the board that I'm gonna start figuring out kickflips on. So I'm so hyped. At first I was pretty worried that all this design on here was going to be a little too much, but now I kind of like it. Maybe I'll do another grip tape art like this in the future. Uh, if you have any suggestions or anything, leave a comment below. Any questions about the process, leave a comment below. 
Thank you to Andy and Sam for helping me out. Links to their channel will be in the description below. All right, that's it for this video. Thank you so, so much for checking it out. Lots of fun stuff coming up and I'll see you in the next one.